Okay. So, in doing these vlogs, I've been getting various different comments from people on many different issues or stuff. Uh, so I'm going to try and address two general directions. Um, one of them was a friend sort of uh, said, um, in doing this, is, is, you're courageous, but isn't there a danger that people who might employ you um, are going to see these and going to go, oh, he's depressed, we can't have him, who knows if he'll be able to work for us. And yeah, of course that's a danger, but on the other hand, if I don't deal with the depression, I'm going to be pretty useless working for anybody. And uh, it has been a problem. So it doesn't make it worse. On the other hand, if I get into a better place, that makes things better. And in fact, since I've been open about it, there's been a lot more opportunities that have come my way and options and things I'm looking at. I mean, I don't know what's going to be the work specifically at any point, but there's things happening. And ultimately, if there's an employer who has a problem with depression as an issue, it's probably a very good idea that I don't work for them because it is not going to lead to a good place ever. Uh, further leads me to various comments I had in various different ways, shapes and forms from people about um, that I'm being uh, too critical of myself, that I'm being too down on myself, and no I'm not. Um, I'm trying to be open and honest about where I'm at and with what's going on inside me. I mean the depression is very bad and I could spend time talking about how deep and dark thoughts get. I'm not going there. I'm talking, my talking is all more about where this depression's at with me, for me to understand what's going on with it and where I can move forward with it. And that requires me to be honest about what's been going on inside me. So without doing that, with brushing any of it aside, without showing the criticism and seeing where things have been going wrong, I won't be able to get there. As an example, I mean, the depression has meant that I feel like a failure. I feel guilt and shame of not being as good a person or having done things as well as I know I can. Um, and that certainly feeds into it. And I need to get out of that so that it doesn't happen. And it's very definitely caused by the depression. The better I handle I get on the depression, the depression and the better I manage the depression, the better I'll be able to work and the more productive I'll be at work and the more work I will do. And also, most importantly, a better father I'll be for my boys. And I feel the most guilt and shame about the fact that I have not been the sort of present father that I know I can be with my sons um, in the last few years. Um, they've gotten much less of me than they should have. Uh, and that's not a good thing. And for them alone, I want to work on this redefining who I am and it's bearing it all out first, speaking about it, pulling it out of me is definitely going to be part of what works things better. So it's not being critical of myself, it's not being harsh on myself, it's trying to be honest with what's going on in me so that I can hear it for myself so I can inform these thoughts and move on from it and we'll see if that works. Thanks for watching. Bye.